How did that make you feel? Taking a pause. That's very important. There are hundreds and thousands of you know researchers that shows that music affects your emotion regulation. It affects your mind. It affects your emotion. So listening to favorite music, watching favorite movie, eating favorite food, everything counts. So in the time of your struggle, find something to do that you love. The last thing that I want to say, and then I'll pass it to you, is the traffic signal, the red, and then amber, and then green. Whenever you're stressed, think of this symbol as you drive. Or even if you don't drive, red means stop. Do something. And amber, yellow means think of a plan. And green means act, do something. Do not just get into this struggle of fighting with your stress. I hope I have covered most of the things. And the last thing, sorry, sorry, last, the last, very last one, sorry. Um, Writing, writing your, writing your thoughts. Your thought is just like a magnet. It is in your head. The one way of taking your thought, your worries, your stress out of your head is write it on a piece of a paper. And you see this. Aha! This is what my mind is telling me, which is my puppet is telling me. My puppet is telling me. And talking to other people. As Mary mentioned, John also mentioned that you can always find someone to talk. Talk to someone. Thank you very much. Do I have time? No. No stress. I know I'm stressing him. I'm stressing him. I'm stressing him. All right. Okay. Uh, the last example. The last exercise. The last exercise. I promise. I will stop. I will stop. I promise. The last exercise. Okay? Keep going. Keep going. The last exercise. Ready? As I said, that talking to other other people, right? It's a great way. I want you to, for the next 30 seconds, only 30 seconds, not more than 30 seconds. I want you to tell person sitting next to you, tell him or her about your clothes. Why did you wear this today tonight? Right? The color, or possibly where did you buy it from? Just tell in 30 seconds, please, please talk to talk to them, talk to them, please. Someone told me that oh, that shirt was given by his father-in-law. Someone told me that the jacket was given by his nephew from Canada. Look at the stories. If that cloth has that story, imagine what story you have as a human being. This amazing story that you have and I want you to be brave to share with other people because this is a great skill 
that you that will help you to manage your stress. Thank you very much. I know it's not easy, but wonderful to have you here.